Blazing with Tutorials and today I'm going to show you how to change your mouse cursor. So the reason I'm making this video is I'm in the process of redoing my how to make your PC look like an iMac because after that video it completely took the entire thing off. As you can see here I have the Mac OS X cursor. I have my little rocket dock. If you want to see the video I made about it check the link in the description below. Anyway. What you're going to have to do is, I downloaded this Mac OS 10 cursor, link will be down below if you want this one, and basically any cursor that has the complete set of files in it, such as if I open this up, and wait for this to exit, and I go into here, as you can see it has a full list of all this stuff, so yeah. So the first thing you want to do is if you whatever you have if it's a folder or whatever I have a WinRAR so if you have a WinRAR just click extract here it's going to extract everything from inside out here there's a preview so I'll go ahead and open that up for you as you can see here we have our little preview like our aqua blob busy grabber all this stuff so let's go ahead and take a look so I'm going to go ahead and delete that preview because I don't exactly need it. Anyway, so what you want to do then is you want to go to your start bar and you want to type in mouse. Don't use your default, like if you have a software that, like if you have a Logitech mouse like I do, don't use the Logitech software. Use the control panel software. So if I type in mouse, click on this one under control panel like that take a second to load and there you go so you'll see mouse properties just click on pointers and you know you got your windows error scheme windows air arrow scheme you want to click on the drop down menu and go to none and then what you want to do is you basically want to take you want to double click each one of these and we'll go into a browse mine's on my desktop so I'll go and enter the folder here and then select it. So that one was normal select. So I'll find normal select in the folder. Right here. And then we'll click open. And we'll do help select. So we'll just click here. Hit H. Working. In background. Open. Busy. Precision select. Think, yep, precision select. All right, wait, I want to. Okay, so precision select, text select. Handwriting. Unavailable. Vertical resize horizontal resize diagonal resize number one and diagonal resize number two move and you just keep doing this until you have all of them once you have all I want to do is click save as and save it as whatever you want. I'll say Mac OS 10 cursor. And click OK. And then you will still have none, but you'll have this new one. Then you just click apply. And there you go. Now you have your Mac cursor. And I would recommend keeping these files, but you can delete them if you want. And now if I take away my start bar or um, enable the uh, finder bar that I have installed, it will look exactly like a Mac, but I would rather move my start bar up, as you can see from the video here. Now I have nothing but the dock and the icons in my 1080p monitor. But anyway, I really hope you guys do enjoy this video. If this helped you, please, please let me know by hitting that thumbs up button, commenting me if you need to have any other further questions but anyway most importantly hit that subscribe button as it does help me out a lot and keeps me going with youtube videos but i hope you guys have enjoyed the video and thank you for watching